sleepy. I don't want to hear. Any place is better than a car. Daddy, let's go. No, we're staying here until the storm lets up. I don't know, Liz. It's pretty run down. running from that cabin. Who'd be running around in this rain? I'll try the office. Oh, don't go. I'll be please. It's getting worse. I hope that trooper's all right. We should have stayed with him. I'd rather be here. At least we'll have a dry cabin and a bed. Mom, I'm getting bad vibes about this place. Oh, it's just your imagination. It isn't. Mom, let's go. No, it's too dangerous. I don't want to stay here. The office was locked. I think, well, why don't we go on? Maybe we can find someplace else. Oh, good. This place scares me. Control yourself. This is no time for an argument. Oh, no. Try it again. No use. Something's shorted out. Now we have to stay. A light went on in the office. Come on, let's make a run for it. Hello. Anybody back there? Just a moment. Good. Oh, look at it come down. <laughs> That's a bad one. Indeed. Uh, the road's almost washed away. We're lucky to find you. Uh, of course you are. See any other cars on your way? None at all. The bridge was washed out and the trooper turned us back. Trooper, eh? I imagine you'll get some more customers if this keeps up. Oh, not really. Five Oaks is too isolated and nothing like their new motel. Oh, barely get any trade. Not even salesmen. <clears throat> <laughs> well, here I'm jabbering on and this should be in a nice warm cabin. Well, we can remedy that. Oh, your daughter? Yes. Why, what a pretty little girl. Dad, let's go. Long blonde hair. Yes, yes. Beautiful. Uh, how much is the cabin? Oh, uh, sure. We can settle up later. You won't be going anywhere in this storm. Please, please. Here you are. It's number seven. The last one on the right. Well, ladies, uh, shall we make a run for it? That's lovely blonde hair. Monroe will take a fancy to her. Monroe? My grandson loves girls with blonde hair. Oh, 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 Pretty hair. Let's go to our cabin. Daddy, let's go. No, Fred, he won't hurt you. Got the mind of a two-year-old. The body of a lumberjack. Monroe like girly. Oh, keep away from her, you. Granny, no hit. Take away your teddy if you ain't good. No take teddy. Monroe loves teddy. Should have had him put away. I couldn't do it. Ken's kin. You'll, uh, take supper with us? Yes, yes, that, that would be nice. Fine, fine. Uh, around six. Enjoy your cabin. <laughs> there it is. Down there. Carry on. He's harmless. Bruce, turn on the light. They don't work. Nothing. I don't like this. I want to go home. Let's try the car again. The door's stuck. Try again. It won't budge. Mom, I want to get out of here. Hello? Girlie? Oh, no! Who is it? Kim! Give me the phone. Hello? Blonde girly. Can I talk to your grandmother? Monroe, be a good boy and get her. Please. All right. Monroe, get Granny. Give me that. Oh, I'll lock you in the cellar. Hello? Look, I don't know what's going on here. 
but the door is jammed and we want to leave. I can't go. I'm too tired. 
Ivy, please. We shouldn't be... Oh, Bruce, she's too weak. And I'm exhausted. This whole day has sapped my energy. Can't we nap for a while? All right. Maybe I'm imagining the whole thing. Get some rest. We'll sleep in ships. Bruce, 
Look out, what? Ivy's gone. She's with them. We've got to help her. It's jammed again. Break it down. Come on. I told me. Go and help me. I'll carry you. No. Help her. Go on. She's so strong. Ivy. Ha, 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 ha.